Good afternoon, I'm Michelle Grizoulis and I'm president of the foundations at Rochester Regional Health and I'm here today joined by two siblings, two twins, doctors Peter and Paul Stasco who are podiatric foot and ankle surgeons at Rochester Regional Health. Hi guys. Hi. Thanks for joining me today. Thank you. For, for those of you who did not know, today is National Siblings Day. So if you have a sibling, call them and say Happy Siblings Day. Mary Beth and Yvonne, Happy Siblings Day. Love you both. Uh, so we thought it would be fun to sit down and talk to you guys today, as we often do. Um, we'll start with a little bit of some doctor stuff, but then we want to have a little fun today on Sibling Day and see how much you two know about each other. So let's first start with, for both of you, when did you guys decide to become doctors? It was uh, you know, pretty early on, actually. Yeah. We both always wanted to do something within the medical field. Um, and really throughout grade school and middle school and high school, made our goal to pursue something within the medical field. Really? It was really around the time that we were in high school that we had a good friend of the family who um, was a podiatrist in our hometown of Batavia. And we had the opportunity to shadow that particular doctor and just kind of fell in love with the profession. Really? So, mm -hmm. Shadowed together? You guys did it together? I shadowed first. I was 14 for okay. a high school biology project and then Paul was shortly after. So Interesting. Yeah. And all throughout college and everything, we also had the chance to shadow him during the summertime. And okay. Did you go to school together, college together? We did. Yes. Mm -hmm. Wow. And I remember your hockey players, right? Yes, we are. I yes, remember are. that. Mm -hmm. So why the interest in feet and ankles? Where'd that come from? It, it lends itself to so many different facets of, of medicine. Um, you know, surgical, non-surgical. Uh, you can deal with wounds, uh, so the, the plastic side of it. Um, and everyone has two feet. So. <laughs> <laughs> so if you mess up with one, you have another one. <laughs> um, this is not one of our quiz questions, but who's, who, who was born first? I was born first. You were. By how yes. many minutes? Two minutes. Um, yeah. So we found out on our 21st birthday, it was revealed to us who was really? born first. So we had all sorts of bets going on. So <laughs> sorry. Mom and Dad kept it quiet. Yes, though. they oh, yeah. did. The whole time. So whoever lost out on a lot of money, I'm, I'm sorry. Wow. Oh, they didn't want any competition. They did not want competition. Wow, good for them. That yeah. takes some serious, uh, <laughs> serious holdout. Um, so, did you guys did you compete with each other a lot growing up, or was you know you kind of yeah, pushed each was, other on? Yeah, there was always you know healthy competition. Yeah. So if one exceeded or one you know excelled in a certain area in a sport or in school, the other one would try and of course keep up. Yeah. So naturally, it was more of a you know symbiotic relationship where um, it was a you know positive uh, encouragement yeah. rather than you know, yeah. competition where one's trying to bring the other one down. Yeah. So, so uh, I, I'm also curious to educate the viewers a little bit on what, um, what are some of the most common things that you see patients for? Absolutely. So uh, a wide variety. Uh, we see patients, we certainly do a lot of uh, reconstructive uh, work within the foot and the ankle, okay. um, treating patients for various tendon and ligament ailments as well as um, deformity. Um, and we also treat patients for uh, routine evaluations. Um, we see a lot of diabetic patients as well within our Oh, our I didn't think about that, you're right. Mm -hmm. What's your favorite thing to see people for? You know, I really enjoy uh, flat feet. It's something that... <laughs> I got two of them. <laughs> <laughs> it's something that um, I really enjoy the, the whole treatment you know, uh, options yeah. as uh, you know, for you know, flat feet. So yeah. certainly something that not only surgically but also conservatively, it's very, very gratifying to treat. Yeah. And we have four or five, you, you both have four or five offices within the health system? Yes, yes. So we have within the Finger Bone and Joint Center uh, three, three offices, okay. cover Clifton Springs and uh, Newark Wayne, and then we're also coming up to Rochester um, uh, General as part of a uh, resident clinic too. And being born in Batavia, you really cover the whole gamut of mm -hmm. our footprint as a health yes, system. Yes, yes. Okay, so we're going to have some fun because it is Siblings Day. Uh, so for the audience, feel free to ask Whatever questions you'd like to, uh, if there's a medical question, of course, feel free to write that in as well, um, or questions of, that you would want to know of these two. So we're going to play a game. You have iPads in front of you. I'm going to ask a question. You two are going to answer based on what you believe to be true, okay. and then you're going to show the audience the answers. So the first question I have is, who's taller? Okay. This is Peter, by the way, and this is Paul. <laughs> Okay, so Peter and Pete. Okay, good. You guys are in agreement on that. All right. We'll pass the first one. Perfect. Okay. Who's the more athletic of the two? Uh. 
Pete, Pete, okay, Paul, very <laughs> honest of you. Of course. Very honest of you, but you both played hockey. Yes, yes. we did. Okay, yes. okay. Um, excuse me, who's the funnier of the two of you? <laughs> this is kind of fun. <laughs> and they're not looking at each other, which is nice. Okay, Pete, Pete, you're three for three. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's try a different one. And this is going to be a hard one because I'm looking at both of you. Who's mm -hmm. the better dresser? Paul and Paul. Yay! <laughs> nice job. Very Thank honest you. to both yes. of you. Um, who's the better cook? Do, do, wait, first, Ooh. do you both like to cook? Uh, yes. 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 Actually, okay. it's funny. Our wives were talking about doing kind of a mock Chopped, you know, competition oh, yeah. for us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anna, you know, just for you know, fun, fun. randomly. Yeah. Paul and Paul, you guys are really good. <laughs> and honest to God, I don't know if you guys can see this, but they're not looking at <laughs> not each other's as they're writing. Uh, what's your favorite things to cook? Your favorite thing to cook? You know, I really like cooking um, Italian food. Yeah. Um, I plan parm and some different things like that. So, and also, I've um, gotten recently into kind of smoking meat and stuff yeah. like that, briskets and ribs. So, what's the heritage behind Stasco? Polish last name, but we are half Italian and half Polish. Okay, so, interesting, yeah. very interesting. Okay, um, who eats more at Thanksgiving? Ah. We should have said Easter. <laughs> <laughs> Paul, Paul, you guys are really good. I'm not counting, but I think we're like six for six. Yeah. yeah. Um, this is a tough one. Who's more compassionate of the two of you? I want you all to know, but he was writing his with very big letters, let me say, very nice. Yes, That's really yes. sweet that you both know that. Um, okay, since you both went to the same college, yes. um, who had the better GPA? Hmm. Ooh, 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 look, we've got a difference. It depends, uh, college or postgraduate school. Oh, yeah. would your answers change? Yes. Yes, they would. Mm -hmm. So postgraduate, you had a better GPA. Nope, um, no. undergrad I did. Undergrad, yes, okay, yes. okay. Had a well, better postgraduate. Okay, well, it all evens <laughs> out so as far as that's concerned. But they were still very close, though. And <laughs> within, they were, actually, it was within, um, I think, uh, two-tenths of a point in college and then one-tenth in, in grad, really? uh, mm -hmm. graduate education. Other siblings in your family or just the two of you? Yes, yes, we do. We have a younger brother who is about 10 years younger than us. Say Mikey. happy siblings day. Happy siblings day, Mikey. <laughs> hey, Mikey, happy siblings day. <laughs> ten years younger? Yes, yes, ten years. Wow. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Okay. Quite you a, must have really age. felt like you guys had your own thing. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Siblings are great. Oh, they really are wonderful. Um, who's mom's favorite? Oh, I'm getting an order. Oh, oh this yes. is good. This oh, is yes. good. <laughs> oh. In so he's order? doing one, two, and three. Your brother's doing one, two, or three. Oh, okay. So I'll give you 30 seconds <laughs> to do right. that. <laughs> We're bringing Mikey into it now. Yes, yes. Okay. So Mikey, Paul and Peter are duking it out for mom's favorite. <laughs> Mikey is clearly mom's favorite. Very cute. Very cute. What's the best memory that you guys have of each other growing up, oh, do you think? So many. Um, hmm. Favorite thing to do together? Of course. I would have to say, um, and we spend a lot of time on the ice together, we're yeah. always on the same line in, in hockey. So um, we had some really great times in, in college playing competitively and playing for Team New York um, and uh, playing at some very high, high levels. I think a lot of those stem back to the time when we were playing hockey, um, setting up nice goals, yeah. things where we'd come back to the bench and the coach went, I don't know how you knew how he was there, but it's oh, got to be yeah. a twin thing. So yeah. I think that's yeah, a general array of those memories for me. I've talked to a lot of twins who do say that there is this sort of unspoken way of communicating sure. between mm -hmm. twins that, you know, who knows where it, it, you know, where it comes from. Mm -hmm. But I have talked to my friends who are twins and they say it's real. Mm -hmm. It's Definitely. real. Definitely is. So I want to thank you both for being here today. Phil, let me yes. just ask if any questions have come in. Who's the better hockey player? <laughs> I'd say the more athletic one. Uh, so. it, it, it depends. You know, I, he, was, he was always the setup guy. So I, I had more you goals, had but I, I, I had to get set up in some yeah. way, shape, or form. You need an so. assist to make exactly. goals. Exactly. Yeah, so, that's true. Yeah. That's true. Before we, we sign off, um, is it, 
I, I find it interesting when siblings or spouses work together mm -hmm. consistently work together. So you guys must see each other every day. Of course. Yes, we do. Yeah. Does that um, ever get difficult? Not at all. It's it's really a it's a great uh, it's been a great thing for our, our practice for our patients. You know, we've been able to bounce questions off of each other for difficult patients, um, difficult surgeries, large reconstructions that we get referred to. We get a lot of referrals. Yeah. Um, from uh, other podiatrists in the area and, and other regions, uh, we'll do some of those cases together that are really long and drawn out and yeah. difficult with a second set of hands. Um, so it's been a fantastic thing. Yeah, and, yeah it really has been. Yes. Say the yeah. same thing. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, I think just from our upbringing, being so close growing up, it's just a natural transition to you know practicing together and having that you know symbiotic relationship like yeah. we've always had. So, yeah, that's great. Absolutely. Well, it's great to see two twins on Siblings Day. Yes. Thank, Thank you very Thank much, you. really, yes. for spending time with us. And um, if there aren't any other questions, we will call it a day. So, again, remember to reach out to your siblings and tell them that you love them. Have a great day. Thanks for being here, guys. Thank you very much. Thank you, Thank you very much. So much. Yeah, yeah. It's fun to learn about you guys. <laughs> Thank you. Yes. I, didn't know, I knew the hockey. I remember the hockey from mm -hmm. you telling me about hockey. I don't mm -hmm. even know how we got on that topic.